Inouye's brother, Anson Inouye, almost faced Guy Mesger in the Ultimate Fighting Championship. It was a tournament in May 30th, 1997. Anson won his first fight. Guy Mesger won his second fight. And Guy thought that Anson kind of dropped the ball and pulled out of the tournament on an injury. And there they go, round one. It may be the striking for Guy Mesger. We shall see. There we go with the low kick. And he's not blocking it. See if he can continuously doing this. There's another low kick. The uh, kicking is allowed now under the new rules with shoes on. A lot of people like Guy Mesger really like to wear the shoes for traction. And Egan coming in with his own low kick. It, it provides better traction, but the only uh, weak point a shoe would have is if somebody went for a leg lock or a foot lock boss. Yeah, heel hook, especially heel hook, toe hold. You don't want to wear shoes for that. But it's nice when you kick, you know, you don't hurt your foot that much. And actually, I don't know if the impact is also bigger. I think, I think that it's not bigger, the impact. I don't think it's more dangerous for your opponent. I think it's going to be equal. And there they are in body lock position. Uh, kind of a Greco-Roman clinch here. Guy getting up top now, trying to slide out. Even, uh, trying to get him up against the ropes, trying to trip him. Won't be easy with Guy Mesger. No, Guy's a good wrestler. He's been in some, uh, in a lot of wrestling matches. Uh, he's been in a lot of fights. He's had 139 fights total, including his kickboxing career, of which he was a world champion. <laughs> Unbelievable. 139 fights. That's a lot. Well, let's see it's like uh, about three years every week, a fight. Yeah, well, he came in kind of light at 202 pounds, and the referee wisely is going to warn them and possibly restart them if they don't get real busy here. There's a knee to the liver of Egan. I think the yeah, guy's going to, guy go to the body there with the left uppercut, and there he goes with the left hook again. Egan keeping a close, smart move there. Left knee there by Guy Mesger to the solar plexus. Egan trying to punch his way out. Don't know if he wants to get into a punch through the Guy Mesger. Mesger looks uh, bigger than Egan. Yes, he does. But Egan looks wrong. That was, I think, a half hit and a knee to the head. Yeah, Guy is really uh, landing the most significant shot. Oh, good right hand there by Guy Mesger. Uh, that really is, is Egan. Egan's dropping his hands now. Not a good idea. Egan's in trouble now. Right hand by Egan Oli. Egan is out. It's over. Guy Mesger has knocked out his third consecutive opponent. His third knockout in a row. Big right hand against that right hand box. Yeah, he's doing great with it. He improved dramatically. Right on the jaw. It was right on the jaw. You will see it in the replay. You know, we picked this one. Uh, Egan didn't have the skills to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Guy, and he couldn't take Guy down, so you're really in a lose-lose situation. And there he is with Ensign and Oi. Uh, it looks like they were... Ans yeah, they're like... Uh, exchanging words there. It looks like Ensign was uh, not taking the consolation real well there. I don't think so either. There's something going on. Let's ask him later. Well, Ensign retired after his last fight, which was against Heath Herring. Uh, there's Ensign with Egan and Oi. 